we start with weekly chart just i want to give a quick update and uh, this is the first time we analyze this one uh, this coin is omg and since it's requested by traders anyway when we look at the chart as we can see the highest price we get almost somewhere around 28 and every time the, we get the sharp move is followed by deep correction and every time the price broke the, the last two times the price broke the previous top it followed by deeper correction i want to see whether we get this one i mean this because as you can see the price broke the previous top is it following by deeper correction or not anyway mostly uh what i'm looking for based on lower time frame i'm looking for correction daily correction or forward correction for continuation all right and this is what we get based on our daily chart we don't see much information if we refer to the indicators because we see the different inform information if um, based on the indicator that's why we are not referring to the indicators the only thing is if we want to look for buy we need to wait for the correction either daily or forward chart and right now we don't see any trade setup based on forward chart daily and we move to forward chart all right based on forward chart since we get this sharp move after we get this correction and right now we're looking at this one as a flat how deep it can go with the breakout of the 15 we can expect the price drop either 14.4 if the price break the 14.4 then we can look for 13 all right this is how deep we can expect even we can expect the price drop some more but mostly if you want to look at this one with the flat we prefer to not see the break go to 14.4 then from there any reversal will take the trade all right because if the price continue and break the 13 then it can be similar to what i explained based on daily chart may this one turn really deep correction anyway Right now we're looking at this one. If you get any reversal as a sharp move flag for me, I will take the trade, okay? And if I move to one hour chart, this is what we can look for. At this point, even if you put this top in relative to the previous one, if you refer to the indicators, we see we, have a di we had a divergence and this is what we get. And right now we look at this one as a flat. And if you get any sharp move flag, we will take the trade. Having a trade above this can be an option. That's mean we can have put a warning tree somewhere around 17.2 in case the price sharply continue all right because if we get any trade setup if we move to a higher time frame the next level with the breakout of the this correction the next level we can look for is somewhere around 22 with the breakout of the 22 we can look for the 27 because if we move to a higher time frame right even if we zoom out i think it's better we move to weekly all right because based on weekly as i show the price for the it haven't tagged the all-time high because if you move to forward so this is what we can see all right and i think we cannot see the price here i need to change it we put on the weekly and as well here if i move to weekly this is what we expected that's mean if the price could break this we get the correction and if you see the continuation the next level we can look for 27 and 20 22 and 27 which is the previous all-time high anyway still we can look for continuation the only thing is we need to get the correction here and if you want to look for buy at least we need to see the reversal as a sharp move flag and for those traders they get the trade within this move at least move their stop loss to break even if they want to keep the trade because what we see based on daily chart i think is better we move to weekly chart again this is what we have seen based on weekly chart every time the price the last two times it broke it followed by deep correction and i don't think so this time we are going to see the deeper correction all right the only thing is based on daily or forward chart if you get a correction we can look for continuation anyway we just follow the chart if i see any update or trade setup i will share and at this time sorry guys and at this time the only way to look for trade as i mentioned either we look for the sharp move flag or we put a warning shape above the top all right because we at this point we're looking at this one as a flat in this case we just follow the chart if i see any update i will share thanks